was born to live, live to ride. Ride to live, I was born to ride. American built, we forever unite. And that's the deal, I was born to ride. Out of Ride is brought to you in part by 866 Law Friend. Ride safe, ride smart. Offices in Palm Harbor. When do you crave refreshing iced tea? Twisted Tea wants to know. The next time you want that same satisfying refreshment, but with a kick, grab a Twisted Tea. Twisted Tea, the refreshing hard iced tea that tastes like real iced tea with a kick. Thanks for tuning in. Historical, world famous, and legendary are just some of the descriptions of this biker bar original. The Boot Hill Saloon, located directly on Main Street on beautiful, here we go again, world famous Daytona Beach. Yep, this is the place with the bras of all sizes hanging from the ceiling and a motto that says, better off here than across the street. Because right across the street is the historic Pinewood Cemetery. The cemetery itself was created back in the 1800s and over the years had fallen into disrepair, but through a twist of fate that brought the world's largest motorcycle rally next door to the landmark biker bar, the Boot Hill Saloon has drawn attention to the cemetery's poor condition and the bikers themselves during Bike Week and Biketoberfest have raised thousands of dollars to restore this city treasure. Recently, Bobby Friss himself entertained the crowd and Born to Ride TV and Magazine were there to document all the fun and to hold a killer bike show. So this week, it's off to Daytona Beach and the, yes, world famous, legendary Boot Hill Saloon. And it's all coming up right now, right here, only on Born to Ride. Do you get our monthly exclusive newsletter? Sign up at borntoride.com and get on our mailing list today. What's up everybody? It's Billy McNight from the Soul Circus Cowboys and you are watching Born to Ride TV. Yeah!
We're having a party and you're invited. Yes, it's Born to Ride's 19th year anniversary trilogy. On Saturday, August the 23rd, it's a party at Fifth Burger in St. Petersburg, a true classic where it all began. And on Sunday, August the 24th, it's at the Green Iguana in Brandon with Bobby Friss in concert live. Win $500 cash and more. And on Sunday, August the 31st, it's at the legendary Peggy's Corral in Palmetto with the Soul Circus Cowboys live in concert. It's going to be a mega trilogy. With more info on the way, a special thank you to attorney Fran Hosh at 866-LAW-FRAN. And a thank you and happy anniversary to you, the biker community who supported us for 19 years. Let's have a party, and we will see you there. I invite everyone to come out at the Green Iguana for the Born to Ride 19th Anniversary Bash, Sunday, August 24th. Jeff Arison will be our special ambassador. Come out and meet him and help him in his fight with ALS, as he will be selling sunflower bracelets that he and his sister make. We'll see you there. in a motorcycle accident. I'm the biker on your side. I'm Fran Hush, your attorney that rides. Motorcycle accidents get my experience and personal attention. And there are no fees, no costs, unless you win. I've dedicated my career to helping accident victims and their loved ones. Your rights are my fight, and I'll never settle for less than you deserve. If you've been injured in a motorcycle accident, please call me at 866-LAW-FRAN or log on to lawfran.com. It's coming, Born to Ride Jam 2, Saturday, November 1st, the biggest, baddest concert event to hit Florida, Born to Ride Jam. Davidson of Tampa, 17th Anniversary Celebration, Saturday, September 13th. Find us on Facebook, Born to Ride TV and Magazine. For over 18 years, the ultimate multimedia biker experience.
having a party and you're invited. Yes, it's Born to Ride's 19th year anniversary trilogy. On Saturday, August the 23rd, it's a party at Biff Burger in St. Petersburg, a true classic where it all began. And on Sunday, August the 24th, it's at the Green Iguana in Brandon with Bobby Friss in concert live. Win $500 cash and more. And on Sunday, August the 31st, it's at the legendary Peggy's Corral in Palmetto with the Soul Circus Cowboys live in concert. It's going to be a mega trilogy. With more info on the way, a special thank you to attorney Fran Hosh at 866-LAW-FRAN. And a thank you and happy anniversary to you, the biker community who supported us for 19 years. Let's have a party, and we will see you there. Hey everybody, it's Billy McKnight from Soul Circus Cowboys right here on Born to Ride TV. Come check us out at Peggy's Corral, August 31st for Born to Ride's 19th anniversary party. Let's do this. Harley-Davidson of Tampa, 17th anniversary celebration, Saturday, September 13th. I've been representing accident victims for nearly a decade, and I've always wanted an office where my clients would feel comfortable and welcome. I'm attorney Fran Hosh, and I've also always been a fighter, never backing down to any insurance company or their attorneys when it comes to representing my clients' rights. Let me deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. If you've been injured in an accident, please call me at 866-LAW-FRAN or log on to lawfran.com. Mojo's Lakeland is a great place to enjoy award-winning wings, half-pound burgers, and ice-cold beer. Whether you're winding down from a long day of work or looking for a new place to find your mojo, Mojo's provides a great atmosphere for you to enjoy happy hour from 4 to 7 every day. Ride out to Mojo's Biker's Night every Wednesday night for the $5 half-pound burger special and $1.50 domestic long nets. Mojo's Wings Burgers Beer, 1845 East Memorial Boulevard, Lakeland. Get mojoed.com. Moto Chubb, El Barrio Young. What are you talking about? Esta es bien cómoda. Yeah. What? Let us see a rapi. You say so. Now you talking my language. That's how we roll. Motorcycles, ATVs, watercrafts, and so much more. You won't get a better deal anywhere. Fun Bike Center Motorsports. Let's have some fun. Now you can take Born to Ride everywhere and anywhere. The new Born to Ride mobile app is ready for you to download. There's more multimedia, more information, more Born to Ride like never before. Dale here from the time machine. Come on, let's go for a ride. You know, I could ride these old belt drive motorcycles every day, all day, and I think they'll really hold up to the test, especially when they're as good of a bike as this machine. The Pope motorcycle made in Westfield, Massachusetts, a tremendously interesting history extremely high quality machine for its day and this little belt drive single yeah, it'll run about 30 miles an hour but it'll run like that all day long you don't want to find any big hills you know I've been collecting bikes for about 40 years and when I found this Pope about, about probably 20 years ago um, it was an incredibly unrestored condition I just marveled at it the machine actually hadn't run in 65 years is what the owner told me I drained the gas and had some in it, drained the oil, cleaned the spark plug, added oil, added gas, and the bike runs just like it does today. I've been riding the bike for years. It's never given me a bit of problem. And truly one of the greatest old marks in the country, the Pope motorcycle. You know what I really like about this bike? Everything! It is absolutely awesome. From the original decals to the original link brake 
there is actually not one part on this motorcycle that has ever been modified or changed. I really doubt the engine's ever been apart. Virtually like a brand new bike, so where this time capsule's been for all of those years, I don't know, but what a bike it is, the Pope, made in Westfield, Massachusetts. You know, let me tell you just a little bit about what I know about this motorcycle. Single cylinder, I really don't know the size. It just kind of pops along at 30 miles an hour. It has a belt drive, of course, with a really interesting motor clutch, so you can actually vary the speed while you're driving. Bosch Magneto, Shebler carburetor. I love the decals. They're absolutely incredible. I think whoever had this bike was kind of a big guy because it has an oversized Troxel seat. I've never seen one quite like it, but the condition of the seat, unbelievable. Original tank decals, very simple controls, very much like a modern bike today, except it has spark timing on the left, throttle on the right, simple choke, simple gas shut off, pedals start to go, and uh, more fun than you could ever imagine. Don't miss Bike Nights, every night featured in the new Born to Ride magazine. A complete listing of Born to Ride's hottest bike nights for you to check out. This month's issue features the Harley Babes on a true classic from Harley Davidson of Tampa on the front cover. And make sure you check out Born to Ride's Page 3 Girl in every issue of Born to Ride magazine. Pick up your free copy today. We're having a party and you're invited. Yes, it's Born to Ride's 19th year anniversary trilogy. On Saturday, August the 23rd, it's a party at Biff Burger in St. Petersburg, a true classic where it all began. And on Sunday, August the 24th, it's at the Green Iguana in Brandon with Bobby Friss in concert live. Win $500 cash and more. And on Sunday, August the 31st, it's at the legendary Peggy's Corral in Palmetto with the Soul Circus Cowboys live in concert. It's going to be a mega trilogy with more info on the way. A special thank you to attorney Fran Hosh at 866-LAW-FRAN. And a thank you and happy anniversary to you, the biker community who supported us for 19 years. Let's have a party and we will see you there. I invite everyone to come out at the Green Iguana for the Born to Ride 19th Anniversary Bash, Sunday, August 24th. Jeff Arison will be our special ambassador. Come out and meet him and help him in his fight with ALS as he will be selling sunflower bracelets that he and his sister make. We'll see you there. Venom Custom Choppers and Bar and Grill. Two locations, Newport Ritchie and Hudson. Every month in Hudson, it's the Customer Appreciation Party, third Sunday of the month. It's the number one collision repair for your motorcycle. Men will get you back on the road as soon as possible. And remember, attorney Fran Hosh says, always ride safe and ride smart. 866-LAW-FRAN. It's High Octane's fourth year anniversary party, August the 22nd through the 24th. There's bands all weekend long, and it's all sponsored by Gingling. Yes, it's High Octane's fourth year anniversary party, August the 22nd through the 24th in Homa Sassa. Hey, Jerry Motorman Palladino here for Born to Ride TV with my tip of the week. Okay, here's the scenario. You're all ready to take a trip. You're going to be gone for a week. You got to take your stuff with you, of course. The first thing you should do is lay out everything you think you need on that trip and then eliminate half of it because I guarantee you're not going to need half of what you think you will. The next thing to do is pack everything in your bag. Now, if you notice this bag I have here, it's huge. It'll carry enough for two people, probably for four or five days at least. It's might hold 70 or 80 pounds, but here's the problem. It's sitting on this rack. This rack is designed to hold 20 pounds. Not because the rack is going to break, but because if you have too much weight behind the rear axle, it's going to lift up your front end a little. It's going to change the handling of the bike. Now, when you have to stop quickly, most of your traction is on the front tire when you 
apply the front brake. If you've got all this weight back here, it's gonna limit traction in the front and that's really gonna hurt. So make sure if you're gonna pack something like this, you have 20, 25 pounds at absolute most in a, a rack like this. If you're traveling solo, just turn this rack around so it sits on the passenger seat. With the bag mounted like this, you could put quite a bit of weight in it. Make sure you put the heaviest items at the bottom towards the seat. Notice now you also have the rack free for lighter items such as a tent or a bedroll. If you want to be a better rider, you got to practice, but you have to know what to practice. For more tips, tricks, and techniques, log on to www.ridelikeapro.com. See you next week. Ramp Free Motorcycle Trailers and Born to Ride are giving away a Ramp Free trailer. Register at Peterson's Harley-Davidson South when you sign up for the Key West Poker Run. It will be given away Saturday, September the 20th in Key West. Born to Ride is a multimedia marketing and promotional machine with TV, magazines, streaming radio, and internet advertising opportunities. There are tens of thousands of motorcycles. We reach the people who ride them. Born to Ride. Find out more at borntoride.com. It's the Plant City Bike Fest, always on the first Saturday of every month. For 12 years, it's been going strong. Now it just got bigger and badder than ever. Born to Ride is TV taping and doing a magazine shoot. See yourself on television and the magazine. Every month, you can win a $500 Harley-Davidson gift card. Sign up to win at the Born to Ride booth. Win a free tire from Cycle Stop. Win $100 for the best of show from Uncle Mike's. There's live music on the 866 Law Fran stage. Better bands, bigger stage, it's all new. Vendors, bikers, and sponsors, this is the all new Plant City Bike Fest like never before. So make plans now for the first Saturday of every month with Born to Ride and the Plant City Chamber of Commerce. Hey, it's the Flashman host of Born to Ride Radio. Make sure you check us out every Tuesday live from 7 till 11. It's AMFM 24 7. Dot com. And don't forget, you can listen to the past shows at borntoride.com. Go there.